Well, I witnessed uh, a couple, two or three gunshots fired off, and I thought it was deer hunters in the back. Mm -hmm. And so uh, I have a lab, so he gets nervous, so I let him in the house. Well, I didn't know it was next door. And so then uh, my neighbor called me and she said, I see fire, I mean, smoke coming out of the neighbor's truck. And she said, I don't know, I need to go over and see what's going on. I said, well, let me check with the neighbor next door and see if he can find out what's going on. Well, he, I, I called him, I could hear him talking, him and his wife, but they couldn't respond to me because I hollered over the fence to him. And then they, uh, so I said, well, let me walk over to the man's house and let him know his truck is smoking. Well, when I did, two police cars drove up. And I almost knocked on the door, and he said, get out of here. And he said, what? And he said, we got a suspect. So I ran across the street to their house, and I seen both of them been shot. And, and they were alive? One was, yeah, they was alive. The one was laying on the ground in front, and the husband was laying in the, in the doorway of the front door. But mm -hmm. both of them had been shot, but they was alive, but they was just uh, I think his wife was hurt a little bit more than, than he was. Is there any feud between the two men? No! Matter of fact, he had just moved here maybe three to four months ago. So he Didn't know him, never met him, didn't know nothing about him, but no feud, no, uh, not, no nothing. So he's believed to possibly be the gunman as the person across the street uh, might have shot them, you think? Uh, he was yeah. the gunman. Yes, he was. And yes. It, what's his condition now, do you know? He's deceased. He's deceased? Okay. Yes. Uh-huh. Do you know his name at all? Nope. Okay. Never met him. Like I said, he was looked like a man that come and go. You might not you might not see him for two or three weeks, and he's come back in, and he might be for a few days, and then he's gone again. Doesn't know nothing about him. Wow. So I just never uh, bothered him. Sure. Uh, how long have you lived here? Oh, we've been here 12, 13 years. Okay. Uh -huh. And your neighbors next door, how long have they been uh, here? Oh, they just moved in maybe six months, eight months ago. Right. And they good neighbors. <laughs> wow. And then for this to happen to him like that, I'm, I'm kind of devastated about it because don't know why he, this man did it, but it sounded like... And you heard, how uh, many gunshots did you hear? Uh, two or three, I know. It was two or three shots. And did he heard. fire at deputies at all? Did you watch No, uh, I didn't see nothing. He must have been in the house uh, because I didn't see him come outside at all. And they was, I mean, they was all around. I mean, so many police cars and stuff. And, yeah. But I was just sad because uh, of what happened to them. Because yeah. I knew they hadn't, they didn't know the guy either and why he picked them. I always wondered why he picked them to shoot them like that. Really? They, they couldn't get the ambulance in here because protection to protect the people from the ambulance to get the people. So they had to bring in uh, some kind of truck that had an opening in the back and put a stretcher and put them on a stretcher. Then they had to drive them out to the highway to get to the ambulance. So that yeah. took them quite a while to do that. And they were going through your mind the whole time? More concerned about my neighbors being all right. Yeah. It's just scary, you know, because yeah. uh, why you picked them? I don't know. I, I think it could have been me. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I think, wow. Yeah. Because I, I was almost getting ready to knock on his front door. Wow. When, they, when, they, when I was telling him he has tr his truck was smoking. Oh, and, my. And I did. I, went, I got ready to knock on the front door, and that's when I turned and saw the police cars, and they said, get out of here. I'm thinking, what? When, I, and soon he says suspect, I think, oh, I'm in danger. So I just ran across the street then to their house and saw him laying there then. That's when I, oh my I saw gosh. him. And I think, ooh. So I, the 